vlog is the Italy vlog. As you can see, we are in the car now. We are just driving up the coastline up to Sorrento. So we actually got here two days ago. Was it two days or three days ago? Yeah, two days. Two days ago. We've just been staying with my sister because she lives out here. So we've been spending some time with them in Naples for the past two days, which is really nice. We just went to really cute like cove beaches and chilled out and it's her birthday and her baby is on the way soon. So we've just been spending time with them, but it is now full blown wedding admin about to start because we're heading up to the Amalfi Coast now. We're gonna go check into our hotel. And then today we're actually gonna go and see our venue and do the walkthrough again and meet some of our vendors, which is really exciting. Because the last time we actually saw our venue, it was back in Feb. Was it January or Feb? Uh, beginning of Feb. Yeah. And it was quite like foggy. It just rained the day before and obviously all the flowers and stuff weren't in bloom. Sorry, this keeps going in now because it's very, very bright and it's very hot in this car. Um, so it's gonna be really nice today. Wow, you can kind of see the coast over here. I'm not sure if it's gonna focus. It's okay. um, <laughs> yeah, wow, well, here it is. Wow. Don't know if you can see it in the back, the stunning coastline. No, we are gonna be doing a walkthrough of the venue with our vendors. Our wedding planner isn't actually gonna be with us here on the trip, but we're gonna basically be doing it over FaceTime. And then tomorrow we're doing our engagement shoot with our photographer and video the team which again is very exciting because we've obviously had a facetimes with them but we've not we've not sorry met them in person yet so it'd be really nice to meet them we're gonna have a lunch with them and whilst we're here as well we need to do all the other wed wedding admin stuff which is for the guests like finding all the great hotels we need to organize the day before and the day after our wedding and finding functions and stuff for that so there's a lot to do on our list um, so we're hoping we can tick it off because we're not actually here for the longest time which it just didn't work out with some of our plans and Chris's work and whatnot so we're trying to make the most of kind of like the 48 hours we have here so I thought I'd pick up the camera take you along with us because we're going to be going to hopefully some nice restaurants and stuff as well because we want to be trialing them out for our guests and yeah it is honestly such a beautiful day today it's so hot so hopefully we'll get to the hotel soon check in drop our bags off and then we're going to go explore i'm very excited just checked into our room we're only actually here for one night and I booked this completely last minute but the staff so far have been so nice this I think this is just like one of the standard rooms just so you can see a better look of the play suit I've just started to unbutton it because I need to go for a wee <laughs> and you know how it is with a play suit but I've just had to put my hair back because I was so hot walking around but to be fair this has been really nice and cool wearing it all day I love the color of it and then I've had my Celine sandals on but my feet are throbbing we've been up since six and just been like non-stop walking around and organizing so it's time for a bit of a relax but i love it whenever you stay in um the italian hotels the i, lo I just love this tiling everywhere i think it's so iconic so yeah it's, it's a decent room for you know booking it last minute it's a really great location close to the town again all the proper kind of like traditional Amalfi style tiles and bathroom and they've actually been very sweet and left us <laughs> absolute mood <laughs> it's very kind of like not outdated but homing into like the older Italian tradition all interior style but yeah this is my complete mood right now but yeah they've been very very sweet and gave us a complimentary bottle of champagne which was very nice to see once we had checked in so We've got a nice balcony here as well, which we can sit out and have a little glass of bubbles tonight. Little balcony area. And actually here, it's like a little lemoncello and cooking cookery class. So you can like make lemonade and do obviously cooking classes here. And I think there's some vineyards, which is a nice little touch. And then you can see the sea over there. So the Sorrento town is just here to the left. So it's a little bit um, of a walk out, like five, 10 minutes, which isn't bad, but it's a really great location. If you're looking for somewhere that's not too fancy, but really great kind of service, it's four star. And then up the top is a nice pool rooftop bar as well, which we'll check out later. But for now, 
it is nap time. Let's not talk about my hair. I'm not sure what's going on with it, but we've just checked into our hotel, which is not this one. This is Grand Hotel Royal, because we're just having a look around some of them. For like, obviously, like we were saying, like venues for before and after, but the views here are stunning. I will clip into it so you can see, and they have like really cute little Lidos down at the bottom. Honestly, I have no idea what's going on with my hair right now. I've been like sat in the car with no aircon, so it's kind of gone everywhere. But yeah, we're just having a look around all the hotels. But if you are looking at coming to Italy and this part of Sorrento, this is a definite good recommendation. There's so many nice little terraces and pool areas. another venue down we just had a look around this is actually so stunning we were saying for um even a venue itself look they have little bits here babe mm. so you could even do like your reception yeah we didn't actually view this one when we were looking at wedding venues but it's a beautiful one it's more of a villa rather than a hotel but we just saw like all the bride stuff getting set up which is so exciting for them obviously they must be having a wedding later today but we're just heading into the main part of Sorrento now, the little town square, which I love. It is so hot today, um, but I'm in this cute little and other stories place suit. I will obviously link it down below, but the only thing we're linen, obviously I've been sat in the car for like a good hour, it's gone all creased, but it is new in, and Chris, bless him, is carrying my bag for me because it's just too hot. Frappe. No, but it's no, like coffee. ice cream, yeah. Guys, I've just ordered this soy ice latte and I actually think it's the best one I've, I'm not joking, I've had in my life. They've put like an ice cream, cream on it. ice creamy top to it and it's look at that thick. Oh my God, it's delicious. And then I've also got a chocolate croissant. <laughs> Calories don't count on holiday. And we're just sat looking out to the nice square. How good is it? I think it's better than a frappe and I never really say that. We're just having a pit stop for a limoncello spritz. We're just at, um, this is Bellevue Serene and I will give you kind of like a walk through the hotel behind because it's looking quite blue here because you can see all the coastline but this is just such a cute little terrace. It's so pretty. All the Italian like the Amalfi tiles but we were so hot. We've basically been going around all the hotels this afternoon checking them all out. Now we're just having a little bit of a break, can't we, babe? Chris is in full wedding planning mode on his phone, making notes. But you can kind of see the view around here as well. So pretty. I would have shown you guys my um, favourite limoncello spritz, but I've already drank it, and here we are. Also, I'm just having top of like my lipstick and stuff, and I brought this away with me. Dior Beauty actually gifted me before I come and how amazing is this hand cream it, it's very much like the Chanel one it just opens up but you can actually use it as like a lip balm cream and body lotion so I'm quite happy with this who's replied oh the planner brilliant okay so yeah we've just got a few hours now just checking out all the hotels and like the beaches seeing what we can sort out and then we're going to go see the venue in around two hours i could not wait to go see it having a little lunch this is one of our favorite places in sorrento it's actually called restaurante sorrento um it's just this cute little back street and we've ordered some mussels grazie hello i'm going some drinks so we've come i feel like i've already said it but we've come back to our favorite place it's just like a cute little back place why are you laughing at me so just before I started recording, the amount she was psyching herself up with this half a shot of limoncello. No, I think it's actually a quarter shot. Okay. No. This shot of limoncello, okay. hype girl. FYI, I never ever ever do shots, but when it comes to limoncello, I'll do it. So refreshing. But we are half an hour away from going to see our venue. I'm so excited. I think we're knackered, aren't we? We just did our full venue walkthrough. 
need the beer. Imagine how we're going to feel on the wedding day, and that was just a one hour walk. Well, no, it was about an hour and a half walk through. Yeah, with that's, our, that's um, over to Chrissy though. With our catering. <laughs> I don't know to be fair, the, cat so the catering woman knew her stuff. Yeah, we just did a lot basically, just because. The last time we saw the venue, it, it wasn't as it is now. Obviously, it's all in the light and the bloom and factoring in timings of the sun everywhere. And it was just so nice to see, though, again. I feel like we didn't take that in, but we did take loads of photos and videos and it stuff so we can... It was, a, it was a bit rushed, but we yeah. got it all in. Yeah, I think we're fine. That's what I'm the like other venue is so up there. shiny. It is hot. I was, like, trying to find any shade possible. But yeah, it feels good. We've gone and done it. We've gone and seen the venue. We've got loads of photos and videos to take. I'm trying to get run over. Maybe we need a refreshment. And then back on to more wedding ambit because we were halfway through checking out one of the hotels and terraces for our welcome drinks. Honestly, if anyone told me this much effort goes into planning a wedding, props to any brides before because so much to think about and so much to do i mean we've got 10 months till our wedding and it's already feeling like a lot i don't think this is the most flattering lighting but we just chilled by the pool for a little bit and then we turned it around i'm wearing this masma duty dress which i actually got in spain my pauline paris bag which i'm sure you see a lot of now it's just an easy bag to kind of take out i've got my soru jewelry hoops in redid my makeup very kind of lightweight and then chris's outfit where's it from babe um, kind of matching mango horse and curtis and oh these are naked jones and we're gonna go out now we were trying to book a restaurant what was it called it's basically where cano the place where cannoli was made right am i saying that right Yes, we tried to book there and we've been called... trying to ring all day and no answer so that wasn't Parciano. that's it so that wasn't a good reservation for us it didn't fall through but i think we should go and try it anyway we'll try it if not we're just gonna wing it and try and find somewhere because it's mm -hmm. so nice place in sorrento but we are hungry and i fancy some pasta In the UK, I love eating early, but it's very much past our bedtime and we haven't even eaten yet. But we did manage to get the reservation, so we're gonna go try and get one now as I walk in. Get some pasta, because we've had a lot of pizza. And now we want some pasta, but we're just walking down one of the main high streets of Sorrento, and I just love it here. It's, it's such cool. a lovely atmosphere, yeah. Like all the nice bars, everyone sat out drinking and eating, and it's just good vibes. I just love it. It's like my favorite place. So it is now 10 o'clock. We finally sat down. We still don't have eaten yet. We still, yeah, we still haven't eaten, and it's ten o'clock. But we do have a good glass of red. Cheers, babe. I think we're trying to be served food, but that is waiting. Oh. I forgot my 
vlog camera tripod so I am currently multitasking by holding this and trying to blend in my concealer which is the Rodeal Banana Low Lighter which I need today. I have not been getting a lot of sleep out here and it's been quite full on like it's been like an amazing trip but not a chill trip because yesterday was a lot we were just walking around and trying to sort so much and then today we were up really early because we just had the car delivered to the hotel i'll leave the company actually for the car because they do amazing kind of like vintage cars if you're looking at doing it if you're coming to sorrento or the amalfi coast and they were so efficient they dropped it off this morning really early and the prices are really good as well so we've hired the car for the shoot today but we've got a few hours actually before because our photographer and videographer are flying into italy today they do actually live here but they've been on another shoot so bless them they've come in for this um so they literally land and then we're going to go meet them they've sent us like this really cool like viewing point along the amalfi coast which i believe is in actually amalfi rather than sorrento so yeah i'm just gonna get myself ready i don't want to do too much makeup but obviously i need something for the photos to look a little bit put together i feel like you can even hear it in my voice um i feel like i'm slowly <laughs> crippling this wedding planning is getting to me but it's just good to be out here and get so much done like obviously we wouldn't be able to do this without being here and on hand and meeting people and speaking to people and finding <laughs> venues and just even seeing like the times of day with the sun everything there's so much to plan when it comes to the wedding and like how it runs with the timings of things so that's been really useful yesterday with the walkthrough going through that and meeting catering and just a lot so today will be a bit more i guess like creative because obviously we're going to be doing the shoot i will put some pictures on the screen actually of the inspo that i've pulled together i want it to be really vintage like that 90s feel you guys know um like nancy mares type of film film content if that makes sense so the photographer has got all the inspo so i'm hoping it all will come together and we're also doing a video as well so we're looking to come up with a concept for invites to do a video invite instead of like stationary to do something a little bit different and also give our so that was the cleaners and to give our guests a bit of a feel of where the venue is and what it's going to be like and like obviously we're making a few days out of it of the before and after and everything like that so i feel like with a video invite it gives a little bit more context to the weekend and then we're also making a wedding website as well with all the info with all the info sorry so we've been going around taking photos of Loads of kind of like recommendations we have for our guests as well. But I'm gonna have to put the camera down because it's hurting me to hold this up and do my makeup at the same time. So I'm gonna show you when it's finished. I'm just putting a little bit of the Chanel bronzer on. This is actually a deeper shade and this is the travel size one, which is really good. So I'm ready. I've actually just slicked my hair back and this is the dress that I'm wearing. It's from by Melina. I love their stuff. I actually had to get it altered. I got it taken up just because it was a little bit long on me. And then I'm wearing my earrings from Soru Jewelry. I thought it was quite fitting with a cute little heart. I have got a little headpiece. It's like a bow with like a net, similar to what I wore for our engagement party, which I think I might wear. And then I've also got, I've packed it away now. I've got my Jimmy Choo heels and this top from by Melina as well, which is so pretty. And again, I had to get this adjusted. I'm sure you'll see it later anyway when I wear it. It's a lovely kind of like puff sleeve, comes in more like corset pleats with the bow, um, buttons, not bows, sorry. And then I'm gonna put that with some shorts. And then I have my iconic Jimmy Choo. So this is actually gonna be the first time wearing them. I'm going to keep them in the bag for now. Lovely bows to go with the dress. I'm going to show you in the mirror so you can see it properly. Here we are. You can see the dress a little bit better now. As you can see, I had to take it up a little bit so it fits perfectly. I just love it. This kind of organza material. It's all floaty, ruffles. Very me. So I thought it worked best to have my hair slip back. I've not put a lot of makeup on, but just kind of this like dewy glow which is what I wanted but I don't usually like shooting middle of the day like this the light's always harsh but we're gonna roll with it
chewing. I think for six hours straight in the heat. I completely burnt all my shoulders. I've not burnt all holiday. And then today we stupidly are obviously in the car. I'm on fire, but I've just come into all my makeup off and just having a nice gelato and cooling off before we head home. Oh, I also went to the shop and got some um, in this bag. I'll show you actually when I get back. Some cute like plates and bowls, um, like the Sorrento print to take home. We just ran and did a bit more wedding admin before we left for the day after to book some areas that we're going to be doing for our guests at one of the places near the beach. But yeah, it has been, I wouldn't say a calm trip, it's been quite stressful with doing all the wedding stuff and shooting and today was way longer than we thought. But it's been good and we're ending it with a high of some nice gelato. Thank you.